Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Velar Mercures. That means all men must die in Game of Thronian language, or Dothraki. <laughs> that was a weird way to start the video, but I feel like that's the only thing I know in Dothraki. If you don't watch Game of Thrones, why are you watching this video? Second of all, you're probably really confused. But let's just start. Well, I'm really hyper right now, and I'm not making any sort of sense because I'm on a caffeine high. And I had a little bit of money on my Dunkin' Donuts card. So I was like, let me get a small coffee. I'll get no sugar, no anything. So it can be like completely coffee. And I asked for a little bit of ice, but he filled it up almost all ice or whatever. But I go to pick up my small coffee because I mobile ordered it. Because why would I talk to a people, to a person, if I could just mobile order it? You know what I mean? I picked up my small coffee and the guy comes up to me and I'm like, I specifically mobile ordered this so I don't have to talk to somebody. He goes, yo bro. But I'm like, yeah. Just a little hint for next time. You should have ordered medium cold brew because we have a promotion that all mediums are $2 all the time. But smalls are 216 for- So I paid more for a small than I would have for a medium. So I was like, oh, you should have just gave me a medium then. He was like- yeah, My manager was right there. So point of that story is I have a little bit of coffee for more money. And I'm on a caffeine high. So back to the video. Game of Thronios, Oreos. I tried to make that work. Game of Thrones Oreos. So if you're watching this, you most likely watch Game of Thrones. And if you don't, you probably know that it's coming out because of all the hype and all the memes and everything online. It's like the biggest show now ever, I think. And it's coming out on Sunday. And one of the things that came out relating to Game of Thrones is Game of Thrones Oreos. And I didn't know these existed at all. And so one day I came home and my mom just like, she brought in a bunch of stuff from ShopRite. And with those, she brought Game of Thronios. Thronios. So right when I saw these, I snapchatted it and I was like, Wow, marketing or something, like something stupid. So after that, yeah, I went all my way. I didn't really give it a second thought. And then a few people responded to my Snapchat. Three people actually. One of them responded. It resells. I didn't take it that seriously because, I don't know, she jokes around a lot. So I just responded, ooh, you a businesswoman. Then somebody else swiped up and they were like, LMAO, keep it and resell it. And then another person swipes up and this guy is like a Russian businessman. And he's probably getting sued by DoorDash or something. He goes, resell it. That's when I decided to go on eBay and I searched up Game of Thrones, Oreos, limited edition, whatever. And I see people freaking reselling like normal Oreo boxes. These cost like $2, by the way, for like upwards of $50. And then the lowest I saw was $11. Did I mention these are normal Oreos that taste the same as any Oreo? And the only difference is, I'll just show you because I opened it because I'm stupid. Oh, well, my family opened it because they're stupid. Except if it's my mom, you're not. So this one's a white walker, Targaryen symbol with the three dragon heads. The Stark symbol with the wolf. Dire wolf. Here's just a single dragon. So that's pretty much it. They're normal Oreos and they taste the same as normal Oreos. But you know what? Maybe I just taste... I only ate two of them, I think, because like I'm skinny. Or it's because my brothers are like vacuums. So they ate most of these. So let me see if I just misjudge it. Maybe there's a flavor here. So I'm eating the white walker one. Why did I get bitter coffee? Because I wanted more coffee, but I got a small. Apparently the Oreo way is to break it, lick it, dunk it, eat it, but I don't have anything. Oh, I can dunk it in here. I can dunk it in my Dunkin'. <laughs> yeah, it's a normal Oreo. The people who are buying this, obviously, if they do choose to buy normal Oreos for $13 that are resold, then they must be like diehard fans. Like they're probably keeping them in a the collection. They're probably gonna freeze them so they don't ever mold. I bet you like if you're a diehard Game of Thrones fan, if you can eat a random Oreo, and then they probably know which one it is. Well, I'm gonna do a little challenge. So I'm gonna take a random Oreo from here. I'm not gonna know which one it is. I'm gonna show it to you guys on the camera. Then I'm gonna try to guess what picture was on it by just eating it. So I don't know which side the actual picture's on. So I don't know which side it is. It might be that one. This is a picture of a... Uh... So I'm gonna try this and see if I can guess. If I fail, I'm a fake fan. And if I don't fail and I get it right, I'm the best game of Thrones fan. The dragon. But anyway, back to eBay. When I saw the people selling this, one of the most popular one was one that was $13. If it's really popular, eBay tells you how much people bought the listing. And 642 people bought it for $13. And if it costs, let's say just $3, each one costs $3. So he makes...
ten dollars profit from each one that's six thousand four hundred and twenty dollars and let's say four hundred dollars off for shipping whatever handling six thousand dollars for nothing he bought oreos and he's selling them to stupid people not me because my mom bought this from shop right for two dollars i was like mom you got game of throne oreos she goes okay which is honestly what everybody should be reacting to it because they're normal oreos they're just marketed differently, which shows you how dumb people are. Oh, by the way, my mom bought two, so I have an unopened one. And I haven't opened it yet. Should I open it? I think I should hide it, because if this finishes and my brothers see this one, they're just going to open it. And I kind of want to see how high the prices go. And the last second is probably like none left, because everybody gets hungry and they eat all the Oreos. Then I have the last Game of Thrones limited edition special Oreo box. I could auction this for... 100k easy yeah. so yeah that's pretty much it for this video i'm just showing you guys how like i said dumb people are the people who resold it are smart it's the people who bought it for like 30 10 dollars more because it's just game of thrones themed you're gonna eat that digest it and poop it out and it's gonna be the same poop disgusting despite all this stuff the oreos are still delicious game of thrones rocks i'm still really excited for game of thrones on sunday i don't know who's gonna win the throne i think nobody should end up on the throne the throne should just burn I wish this was a dragon. <laughs> I don't have any Game of Thrones clothes. Yeah, I'm a fake fan. I don't have any merch. I have Oreos though, so who's the real fake fan? You have a Game of Thrones shirt, which you can buy. I have limited edition Game of Thrones Oreos, so who's the real winner here?